Wednesday morning to you all. Hope you had a good day yesterday. Today our gospel is from Mark chapter 9 verses 37 through 40. And it's a short one. Uh, in it is that the disciples come to Jesus. And uh, one of the disciples, John, says, Teacher, we saw some guy expelling demons in your name, so we stopped him. And Jesus says, Don't stop him. He's doing good. And he says, anybody who's with us is with us. You know, who's not against us is with us. Um, and so in this, uh, here's what I find, you know, because if we go back uh, a couple of days ago, you know, disciples were trying to get rid of a demon out of a, a child, and they couldn't do it. And now this man, who's not even part of their group, is just explaining demons evoking Jesus' name, is successful at it. And I think their egos are taking a bruising. I, uh, well, they're men, after all, they have egos. So I get the part, it, kind of the message in us, for us to is, you know, when do our egos get away all the time? But, you know, we got to look at how our egos prevent us from seeing the good, participating in a good. You know, if it's not me that's doing it, then it's not any good. Yeah, that's our ego talking, you know. When we knock down other people for doing something that is good, well, that's probably our ego talking. And if we examine a lot, I think we're going to see our ego talking quite a bit. And with Lent starting next Wednesday, so a week away, maybe it'd be an opportune time to, uh, to reflect on our ego and to think how we can work to minimize that so that we can participate in the good that is happening in the world around us. All right, so I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, bye-bye.